Hi guys, Wendy here. In this video, we're going to draw my Drasa cute Chihuahua. So let's get started. With this Chihuahua, we're going to first start by drawing the top of its head. So right here, we're going to draw a big curve. This is going to be the center, the top of his head. Nice soft curve. And then we're going to start to bring it around. So it's kind of like my usual draw so cute heads. Where it's a little bit tapered at the top and it starts to come out a little bit more towards the cheek area. And then I'm going to start to bring it in. So this head is a little bit rounder, not as wide. Because it's a little chihuahua. <laughs> I always love saying the word chihuahua. Okay, so bring it in and we're just going to connect it. Okay, so there. It's almost a circle, but not really. It's just, it's a little bit flatter at the top and it tapers a little bit on the sides. Okay, got that shape in. And then from there, let's bring in the big Chihuahua ears. Uh, so towards the edge right here, I'm gonna start to pop out one huge ear. That's what makes a Chihuahua. It's one of the distinct features. Okay, so one big curve about right there, and I'm come in and bring this one back up. And I'm just gonna come in here and add a curve to give this ear some dimension. And then let's go to the other side. So I'm just gonna go right across, give myself some points so I know where the other ear should go. So about right there. And I'm gonna bring out this curve. So before I finish that, let's just go from that point. So let's just give it approximate, say about right here. And that's where you wanna to head towards. And don't worry if it's not perfect. It's not going to be, but we just want to try for almost the same size and the same um, area. So then same thing right here. Let's just come back in here and add that curve. Okay, so we've got the two ears in now. The two huge <laughs> Chihuahua ears. Okay, now let's bring this cutie to life. So I'm gonna start by drawing the nose first, just so I can have a nice anchor. And so right in the center right here, towards the bottom, I'm gonna draw his little nose, little curve, and then bring it in to a point. And then from there, now that I have his nose in, let's come to the sides right here. And I'm gonna draw a big circle. Really big one. These chihuahuas have those big buggy eyes. So over here, same thing, towards the edge once again. Oops. And draw another big circle. Okay, so then from there, let's make them draw so cute eyes. We can come in here and draw a big highlight and then a smaller one and then connect it with a curve right here at the bottom and shade in the top. So I've had this request for a chihuahua for, I don't know, the longest, longest time and I was never really comfortable drawing dogs for some reason. I like drawing cats. I thought they were just a lot easier to draw. <laughs> But lately I have been really practicing and really trying and I think I finally found my style for drawing dogs. I just drew a pug um, not too long ago so please check that out. And so I think I'm going to continue drawing dogs because they are so cool. And so hopefully I will continue to get better <laughs> at drawing dogs. And so then right here, a bigger highlight and a smaller one, and then curve line at the bottom. Put in the lines, and then shade in the top. Okay, so there, and then just shade in all of it.
And there are just some days where your hand just feels a little bit more um, comfortable and stable. And then there are days when just like no matter what you do, it's just all your lines are a mess. Kind of like today, my lines are really wobbly. <laughs> And it's all okay. Okay, so there, got the eyes in. And then what I'm gonna do right here, because it is a chihuahua, if you're comfortable with it, what I'm gonna do is um, you can try just giving it a tiny little point right here, just to make it so it's not a perfect circle, but it has a little edge. So I'm just gonna come in here you can see it. I'm just going to add a tiny little point to it, but it's a soft point. Okay, so do you notice that soft little point? I just felt the chihuahua kind of needed that, so you can do that to the other side, but just make it very slight. You don't want it pointy. So just add a little edge to it. So like that. Okay, and then come up here, and I'm just going to draw a little curve right here on both sides. So your eyes are kind of buggy. And then I'm going to come out here and add a lash. Just one, and one right here. And then now to draw the uh, mouth. So I'm going to come down with a straight line, and then right here just curve it out. Same thing on the other side. Then just cap it off. So there, got the cute little chihuahua face. <laughs> and then now to draw his body, its body. So it could be a boy or girl, whatever you want. I'm gonna come towards the center right here and just draw a little neck. Now if you're using a pencil, just go ahead and finish off the body. But I'm gonna stop right here. I'm using a Sharpie and I'm gonna curve and give him this nice thick collar. And then right here, I'm gonna continue imagining this line being continued going down. And because it is a chihuahua, it's gonna be small. So I'm gonna to start to bring it in about right here. And let's continue this curve all the way down. A nice cute little chihuahua. Okay, so then from there, let's come about right here. Well, let's bring this. Hmm, maybe it's easier to draw the body. So we're gonna come about right here where the, put the body and we're just gonna draw a little curve right here. So this is the little body and then we can bring this leg back up. So just nice soft curve and bring it up. And then the other leg bring it up and then we're going to continue this curve so we're a little tummy and we're going to bring it up and then right here we're going to draw the back legs so go right here and connect it and right here the back ones so there, I got our little body, and then let's come in here for the collar area. And of course, you're gonna add a little heart because it's a draw so cute chihuahua. And right here, let's give him a little tail. So, um, but right here towards the back, and connect it. So that's about it for this cute draw so cute chihuahua. Hope you guys love it, and if you do, please give me a thumbs up and share it, and remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new draw so cute videos. See you later.